Hello and welcome back to our channel Mini Medicos. Today's our topic is Roots of Drug Administration. There are two types of root, local roots and systemic root. In local root, the first one is topical root. In this, drug is applied on skin or mucous membrane. After that, intra-articular root. In this, drug is given into the joint. And the last one is intrathecal root. Drug is given into the vertebral column. Now, the second type is systemic root. It is further divided into two, antral and parenteral. Antral is further divided into two, oral and tractal. In parenteral, intravenous, intramuscular, subcutaneous, sublingual, transdermal and inhalational. Antral root. The first one is oral root. In this, drugs with high first pass metabolism are not effective orally, example nitrates and lignocaine. Rectal root. Diazepam is given by this root in children of febrile seizure. Parental root. First one is intravenous root. Has 100% bioavailability. Intramuscular root. Injection is given deep down into muscle. Subcutaneous root. Insulin is given by this root. Intradermal root. Injection is given at the angle of 10 to 15 degree and a blood must be formed. Transdermal root. This, this root is used only for the drug which are highly lipid soluble. Inhalational root. Drugs given by this root include salbutamol, epratropium, inhalational citroid and inhalational anesthetic agents. Sublingual root avoid first pass metabolism can be self-administered and also after getting the desired action rest of the drug can be spitted. Now here is the picture in which we show you angles for giving injection. In this picture in intradermal root blood is formed. In this picture in subcutaneous root drug can be self-administered insulin is given by this root thanks for watching our video please like and subscribe our channel mini medicos